Okay, so we kind of done with this piece and before we link together, let's go ahead and look back to our preview. Okay, we'll go to overview, select and we'll go to peaks. Okay, so I enable peaks. And from this point, I want to go ahead and create a new layout. So as a new layout, I want to use a box for this. So we'll go to create a box. Okay, and notice right here overlap. So what I want to do with this box, I want maybe even overlap more and we can move just slightly out. So this is area where they will be kind of overlapping, blending to the each other. Okay, same we can enable breakout. So just leave it, give it us view. And on this case, we can go back to our view and right here we have it, our uh, view. So we'll go ahead, let's set name. And I'm going to call this um, peaks. So we can kind of easier to find. Okay, and we can set name for this as well. Okay. So right here, our layout will just generate a little bit here. Well, let's create the peaks as easy way to do by using Kubernetes. So we'll use it this as default. What are we going to modify slightly? Let's go open and um, we can use it on a scale. So let's pop up scale, maybe a little bit just slightly. All the settings will leave it the same. You know, just you can play if you want a little bit with the shape. See um, if you want something, you may like it better. And I uh, guess we can enable distortions if you want it. But in this case, we'll just leave it them on. So it's a very, very basic setup. We'll go click OK. The next what I want to do, it is um, bring kind of equalization or increase them. So the peaks will go up. Uh, for this one, we can go inside the filters and right here we can find our equalizer. So let's put an equalizer in our place and we'll go to connect. And equalizer, you can see already how it works. We'll leave it everything as default. But you can see before and after, so we kind of increase some of those portions. And the next what I want to do is to give it those nice peaks look. So for that one, we'll go um, in a natural, we'll take our erosion. But in he, this case, we'll start using more work as the harder rock, hardness and other things. So we can take switch to channel erosions, just give it better effect in this case. We'll take ours and bring maybe 170 should work fine. Let's bring this one also. So you can see how now peaks will start applying. We can add rock hardness just slightly and carrying amount maybe a little bit less. So right here, this is create a very nice peaks. Again, I'm previewing just in this area, which is kind of nice. So let's click OK. Um, one thing what I like to do is sometimes log preview on one node. On this case, if I increase reduce scale, I can see how it will go. So maybe, you know, maybe I even take a little bit down. So we'll believe it more peaks right there. Let's look on our, remember we have it our equalization. So we have it our equalizer set. And this is work. I think it's work very well. Okay. Yeah, that will work. Nice. So, okay, let's go next. I want to combine these two nodes. So I'm going to um, combiner. So we'll add one combiner here. And we're going to set one combiner. And from our erosion node, okay, we can go inside open average and it will just go all the way. So you can see I'm almost like going all the way to other point, but I don't want this effect our other node. So if we're going, okay, let's go to overview. There you go. Main extension. Let me go. There you go. Select main extension on this one. Okay, and if we look on the main extension, it's affecting everything. So I want to actually control. So I'll go take peaks. 
from ours and I'm going to control by mask input. So you see right here, this is corner, it's what we control it. So if I look now in my combiner, and you can see now we start having controllers areas. So we have our mountain and we also have those peaks. This is a blending area, it's where you can work more. So you can add another small piece between them and blend that way, or you can extend a bit more on a mountain, so it's up to you. Uh, there are other things also you can blend by going inside the combiner and by using this average, so we can kind of, you can set a bit more, but look right here. So we control just that area with this. Okay, so we'll go right here, let's set this way, we'll go back to preview. And I can go to the mountain, select, and maybe, you know, even kind of growing even more plant into here. So again, you can see how it's better work, this area. Okay, so let's go back to our zones. And um, here's our peaks, mountain. We'll go tweak a little bit more, but next we'll go work with our terrain, uh, terraces one. 